Hey guys, so um, the Lord was prompting me to get on this morning and to pray a prayer over you guys. Um, so we're going to pray this in agreement together. So get out your Bibles. Um, I'm going to read this in the Passion Translation and it's Psalms 121. Um, uh, much, many of you may have already studied this out, but Psalms 121 is a rapture psalm. And in fact, it's coded in Hebrew. It's rapture is coded in there. And it is a rapture psalm. And, it, psalm, and, it, and it's called one of the Psalms of the Ascents. How cool is that? I like it in the Passion Translation. It says, a song of the stairway. So awesome. So we're going to declare this over you, over your families, over your businesses. This is over everything that you have to do with. We are declaring this now in Jesus' mighty name. Because he wrote this in scripture, it is so. So we are declaring it. We're making a declaration, okay? So this is how we do this, and I'm praying this for everybody who's watching this video, not just the channel family, but whomever else may see this. Hallelujah. Praise God. Okay, so Psalms 121. Here we go. Father God, we come to you in the mighty name of Jesus, according to your word. And we pray this, Father God, for every viewer of this video, in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you for the protection you've given us. Therefore, we speak, so speak and so act as people should who are to be judged under the law of liberty, James 2.12. And so, Father God, we're doing this. We're speaking and we're acting. We're doing what you said to do. And we're declaring this over our lives. And we thank you for it in the mighty name of Jesus. Psalms 121, Father God, you said, I look up to the mountains and hills longing for God's help. But then I realized that our true help and protection come only from the Lord, our creator, who made the heavens and the earth. He will guard and guide us, never letting us stumble or fall. God is our keeper. He will never forget nor ignore us. He will never slumber nor sleep. He is the guardian God for his people Israel. Jehovah himself will watch over you. He's always at your side to shelter you safely in his presence. He's protecting you from all danger, both day and night. He will keep you from every form of evil or calamity as he continually watches over you. You will be guarded by God himself. You will be safe when you leave your house and safely you will return. He will protect you now and he'll protect you forevermore. So, Father God, we thank you for this. We thank you that we are safe and protected in everything we do and every place we go. We plead the blood of Jesus, Father God, upon ourselves, our homes, any places we may be staying, upon any transportation we may be traveling upon, upon all our places of businesses, our, uh, place of business, and any place we may go. We plead the blood of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus upon our family. We plead the blood of Jesus upon the streets that we live upon. <sighs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And I ask, Father God, for your mercy for today and also for your grace for today. And I receive it for all of us in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes and amen. It is done. Is it? It's done. It's done. And you've told us to pray for grace and mercy. So I'm doing that now as a declaration for everybody watching this video. And I thank you for it. We receive it. We glory in you, Lord. Hallelujah. For you are good and your mercy endures forever. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Lord. We ask all of this in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, if you don't know the Lord Jesus, call on him. Just tell him you believe. You believe he's the son of God. You believe he died for you to pull you out of sin and pull you out of all this nonsense in the world. To, to draw you into him. Tell him you believe. All you got to do is call upon the name of the Lord. Call out to him. Cry out to him. Be sincere from your heart, not from your head. Not just thinking, well, I'll do this as an insurance policy. Uh-uh. Do it from your heart. Because we are in the last seconds of the last days. Tribulation is going to happen anytime. And when that happens, we're out of here. And if you try to wait until we're out of here... It's not going to be a pretty time for you. You don't want to be here for what's coming. Okay? The Lord loves you. He's calling you to himself. Run to him.
in the name of Jesus. I thank you for it, Father God. I thank you for bringing people to you, hallelujah, to save them out of the mess that's coming. I thank you for it, Father God. Hallelujah. I thank you for it. Amen. Okay, so um, mm, there's some other things I want to tell you about, but I'll see how the Lord leads because I'll, I'll just see how the Lord leads. All right. Love y'all. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.